When you hear the word biosphere, it's hard to know exactly what to picture. But on today's cruise, that's exactly what we're looking at. But what exactly is a biosphere? Any thoughts, gang? I think a biosphere is the variety between having a healthy river system and a healthy mangrove system in which the animals can have a good habitat and rich nutrients. Now I've been told there's a couple of biosphere experts on board who can tell us if we're on the right track. What is a biosphere? A biosphere is international recognition of three basic principles, which is conservation, sustainability and learning. So in our case, it was recognition of what this community was already doing. And this happened in 2007. What does an area have to have to make it so special? It needs to have significant biodiversity values, businesses that are prepared to try and be sustainable or work towards sustainability, and also education is a really important uh, factor as well, both in terms of our youth and volunteerism, that people help the community, help the conservation status, and work together as a team. It's a celebration of community, is a simple way of putting it. So we're talking about community living as closely as possible in harmony with nature. Exactly. It's the interaction between man or person and the environment. So it's not just locking it up like a national park, it's encouraging businesses to adopt sustainable practices and work together to try and keep this land in as good a possible condition as we can for our kids. One of the more visual aspects of the biosphere here is the fascinating and varied bird life that call the region home. Yes, Stacey, so we're very lucky in Noosa. We have a, a wide range of bird species and we believe 43 different species and that rivals Kakadu and that's world renowned. Wow, so. and so you don't have to really go very far along here, along the waterways to, to see some bird life, you just have to have a keen pair of eyes. Mm -hmm. uh, I understand you've got migratory species but lots of local resident birds as well. Yes, and at the moment they're the main dominant species around, although we do have a full range of raptors. We have kites and harriers and falcons as well. And all those things combined with um, a rich food supply in the sand and the mud is we've got all those little species growing into bigger ones, providing food for those big raptors. There's some That's great it. pelicans over there too. Yes, the pelicans. People love the pelicans. So you'd say that is the key to, to this biosphere and having so much, so much bird life, it's, it's a good place for them to come and rest, to breed, to feed. To breed and feed. That's it. Well, if you haven't figured it out already, biospheres are pretty special places. And it looks like that when it comes to their health, we're all responsible for keeping them that way.